Don't ask me why I went there. I thought those were the Gaia manuscripts, so I was confused why I didn't bring them with him, but they aren't the Gaia manuscripts. So now we leave. We leave. And we view cut another cutscene. Actually, I thought this was in Shamar, but let's see. But it isn't. It's in the seventh continent. The only time you see actual geographical land that isn't. Well, I won't spoil it for those of you who haven't seen it, but those of you who have know what I'm talking about. And there we are, Eggman's base. And he's got one billion eight no he's got three hundred trillion, nine hundred and eighty five billion, one hundred sixty three million, three hundred and seventy three thousand. One hundred and eighty nine robots. I mean all units converging on point zero. Yes, yes, perfect. Gathering Dark Gaia's pieces is such a pain! I'll have them come to me instead! A brilliant shift in perspective! A brilliant An way to be lazy, you know, like it's... Redman, super genius! <laughs> Owned! It's the silent slap of doom! This, it owns all! Only the... Uh, it, it is unpowered the Falcon Punch! Get those energy conversion circuits warmed up! Understood. Commencing Project Dark Gaia. Requesting final clearance. Granted! Falcon Smash! Finally, my ambitions will be achieved! So that giant radio tower, for some reason it reminds me of the, crim of the uh, Crimson Tower that in Sonic Hunters with Gravity. I don't know why. Anyway, so yeah, we're automatically forced to go to Shamar. And that just reminded me of something. I still don't get why people get lost in these hubs. Look at how look at the small design of this hub. Just look at this map. How hard is it to find your way around this hub? Alright, so there's the map. Screw that thing. Screw that. Find the professor after. First, we need to collect the moon metal. And there are four total. And that's actually a shortcut. It's a very convenient shortcut for Sonic. So even in the hub world, Sonic can move around faster. And there's actually a metal back there. I didn't see it, but I don't worry, I do grab it. I just took it over here. So there's the moon metal. I'm forgetting to interact with the people here, but don't worry, I remember too, because I know we have to get that out of achievement. It's all for And actually, I felt like talking to this guy. Because this guy, you know, you know those teas that we kept collecting in different areas? The red tea, the like blue tea, the idea, and everything? He, he is the reason why. He is the guy that we were fucking for, really. Oh, this guy. That guy back there, for some reason, I don't know how I never talked to him. For a very long period of time, but he was the last guy I, I talked to before I got close to Butterf Butterfly Juice. And I'm like, how did I not notice him? I had significantly been in depth with other missions and everything before I found him. Anyway, he's the sister of that girl, the one who's lost, who lives here in Shamar, area representing Egypt. I think, and, um. No, 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 questions. They talk way too much. She forgot to get married, she talked too much. Those two forgot to get married because like, yeah, 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 yeah. It's air hunger, blah 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 blah. Yeah, 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 we get it. I still like how they have individual profiles, and I'm looking around because the rumor you- I, I swear to god I saw the Temple of Guy in the background. Also, I swear to god in the ending, it shows the police, and I swear to god I saw the, the, moon, the moon right below the sun. Makes no sense. Even in this place. 
Why am I going liquor again? Alright. Easy win. Village of Flag! The Flag! The Flag will flag you! And your videos will not exist anymore! And I will win over you! Because I am an annoying spammer who will flag your videos and YouTube will forget! Um, anyway, uh, yeah, 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 this guy imitates someone else. Not just in clothes, but in many ways. Alright. Yeah, this is one of the first ones to grab my attention because it's just so weird. But pretty committed to a piece in Shamar. Oh, please, that's pathetic. She's like a ton. She's basically a ton. She's into basically like all action and shit. And it really ends up being trouble for you, especially since one of the missions involving her. It's probably the most annoying mission. And it's saving her freaking ass because she, she, she had to be such a such, a, such an egotistical crazy person. And he got herself in trouble. Okay, this is basically Shamar's equivalent of the assassin. does not move out with you. Well, I think it does in the Weaver, you know, I'm not sure about that. More like unlucky me. Now start making me fried baloney while I go talk to Melissa. Good day. Good day to you too, sir. Now suck your. Now suck yourself off and die. Sorry, sorry. Before I shoot you. Shoot you with my finger. My finger gun. That will somehow kill you. You know, yaddy yaddy yaddy, he's telling us to do stuff we already know. Oh wait. Yeah, he talked about Empire City. Great, just great. That's not stuff you don't hate that stage to hell. Especially on your first time screw. It's an ass bitch raper. I appreciate your confidence in me, Santa. I will not fail you. Alright, till next time.